You know, uh, if Emilio was here, he always starts his remarks by saying, The Way is a film that you can take your parents to. <laughs> they won't be embarrassed or insulted. Or they won't have to cover their eyes or their ears. I can promise you, there's no violence. There's no uh, sexuality, language. There is no um, uh, 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 car chases or... or CGI or whatever they call it that you know where monsters are coming and big things are beating them up There's none of that. It, it's, it's a and yet it's a story of a father and son who are working their way across the Camino The, 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 the son has been lost uh, during the journey and the father uh, is carrying his ashes to fulfill uh, his pilgrimage and in the in the journey he becomes himself and he becomes the father to these three other knuckleheads that uh, he was never able to be to his son it's a story of renewal and healing. It's also a story of redemption and faith. Because uh, 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 as you go on pilgrimage, and those of you that, that have done pilgrimage wherever it is in the world, know that you prepare yourself uh, long in advance and you uh, carry all of your belongings that you'll need on this journey on your back. And as you proceed, and this is quite normal of all the pilgrims, uh, that after a few days they begin to unload some of the unnecessary items they pack. Books are the first to go. There are a lot of libraries along the Camino <laughs> in all different languages. And other, the extra pair of shoes and pants and so forth, they get it right down to the absolute necessity that, they'll, that, that they, they want to carry. And as that happens, eventually the, the uh, shedding of the uh, extraneous things of the spirit begin. Uh, as the transcendence begins, the real pilgrimage starts to take place on the interior. And the pilgrims begin to open up their heart and they begin to uh, unfasten uh, the locks to the uh, dungeons of the heart. They begin to let go of anger and, and judgment and envy and all of the things that have kept them from being themselves. They let go of all their enemies uh, uh, th that uh, they've been hanging on to and punishing because they have not received enough punishment out there uh, and they don't trust God to punish their enemies and so they hang on to it. and then the pilgrimage eventually ends with, with a, a much lighter load and that's the transcendence and that's what what that's really the, the, the most important thing that people take from pilgrimage is that inner journey uh, it is also about community uh, it is said that you must carry your burdens, both the interior and exterior burdens, uh, and you must do it alone. No one can do it for you, but you cannot do it without community.